Ben Bernie. Good morning from Hollywood Happenings. And today we're over at the star of Benjamin and it's going to know professionally as Ben Bernie. He was a jazz, American jazz violinist, uh, band leader and radio personality, often introduced as the old maestro. He was born on May 30th of 1891 in Bayonne, New Jersey. I October 23rd, 1943, in Hollywood, Los Angeles, California. He's married to Rose, he's married to Rose Bernie until 1935. <clears throat> and some of his albums, including Ben Bernie, the old maestro, salute to New York. His full name was Benjamin A N Z E L W I Z. Now, Sweet Georgia Brown is a jazz standard composed in 1925 by Ben Bernie and Matt Crow Pinkard uh, with lyrics by Ken, Kenneth Casey. And the reason why this song was so popular is known by everyone, mainly because of the Harlem Globetrotters have been using the tune for the same song since 1952. Even fiddlers love this song, and it's a popular bluegrass tune in addition to being a great jazz tune. Now, Ben Bernie Star is located at 6280 Hollywood Boulevard for the category of radio. And that's located between Hollywood and Vine and Hollywood and Argonne near the W Hotel. Now, Ben Bernie born Ben Bernard, A-N-Z-E-L-E-V-I-T-Z, -E -E American jazz violinist and radio personality, often introduced as the old maestro. He was noticed for his showmanship and memorable bits of snappy dialogue. Now, by the age of 15, he was teaching violin, but this experience apparently diminished his interest in the violin for a time. He returned to music, Darren Vaudeville appearing in the Phil Baker as Baker and Bernie but he met with little success until 1922. When he learned his first orchestra, later he had his own band, The Land, seen in the early De Forest phono film sound short, Ben Bernie and All the Last Lads, featuring pianist uh, Oscar Levant. He toured with uh, Maurice Chavlau and also toured in Europe. Bernie or Bernie or Bernie's orchestra recorded through the 1920s and 1930s. Vocalization, Brunswick, Columbia, Decker, Arc. In 1925, Ben Bernie and his orchestra did the first recording of Sweet Georgia Brown. Bernie was the co-composer of the jazz standard, in, which has become the song of the Harlem Globetrotters. Now his musical variety radio shows through the 1930s, usually titled Ben Bernie, the old maestro was usually successful with the ratings, placing him among top radio top programs. He has he was always on radio as early as 1923, broadcasting on WJZ and on the Blue Network in 1930-1931, sponsored by M E N N E. And after 1931-32 run on CBS, sponsored by Pam Spear. He was heard Tuesdays on NBC from 1932 to 1935, also with Pips, his announcer during the period with Jimmy Wallington. Hollywood says, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, notification bell, leave a comment, let us know what you think. Mm -hmm. Hollywood says, every star has a story, so click on that link. So you can find out the true story and history of the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Hollywood says, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and hit notification. Hollywood says, don't forget.